kind of bowlers we have right now, you know, they have done pretty well in domestic circuit and uh, whatever international cricket they have played. Uh, I know they have, they are not too experienced, uh, but it's the same with the South African attack. You know, their bowlers are not experienced enough. Uh, but yes, uh, you know, when you when you play these kind of tournament, that's 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 how you grow uh, as a cricketer. So sometimes you know things don't go your way. And that's what exactly happened in Dharam Shala. With, with the due factor coming in, it was pretty pretty difficult for the fast bowlers to, you know, control the line and length. So I'm sure that's that's not an excuse. We have to we have to you know b stick to what we can do as a team as as a, as a bowling unit and you know come out uh, all guns ba uh, blazing. You know we have to we have to win this next game and to do to do that you know. A lot of things uh, we have to do, right? Uh, that starts from, uh, you know, whether it's batting or bowling. We have to start really well and get that uh, win. Yes, uh, it was, it was a unfortunate loss, but I'm sure we, we will come back strong. Back home before coming to India, we, um, I personally prepped a lot with our coach uh, Rob Walter. Uh, we prepped a lot for spin. Um, and he looked at, at definitely helped, especially in those middle overs in the T20. India generally bowl a lot of spin in that particular period and it was nice to stay calm and uh, JP had a common influence over me. It's not a disadvantage at all, you know, each team has their weaknesses and their strengths, you know. Um, Australia has four or five bowlers that bowl 90 mile an hour and we've been fortunate enough to have um, four, four, four bowlers that, do, that bowl 90 mile an hour, you know, more than and they'll come in for the ODI series. We'll, we'll bolster that particular reserve for us. But then again, India has four or five quality spinners. So, you know, each team has their own strengths. Um, uh, so we, we prepare accordingly. Uh, and as I mentioned in my first answer, you know, I prepared uh, specifically for a lot of spin, especially on the subcontinent. You go to Sri Lanka and Bangladesh, you face a lot of spin. Um, so it's not to their disadvantage, their advantage is they have a lot of spinners. So, you know, we have to combat that as a batting unit as well. So, you know, we're going to have to prep according today. I have a look at the dimension of the field. Um, there might be a lot more ones and twos, potentially even more threes. So running between the wickets might be important from a batter's point of view. Uh, and maybe from a bowler's point of view, we can protect um, certain pockets on the field. You know, if it's with slightly bigger dimensions, I have slightly different plans uh, than um, Dharma Sala. So, I mean, that was, I mean, 400 runs in nearly 40 overs was a bit of a freak thing, but um, yeah, look, we, we're going to prep accordingly in, in, in the next couple of hours and hopefully we can uh, get some good game plans before tomorrow.